Are you ready? I wait, wait. I'm not ready. It's upside down. I never <laughs> thought I would find a shirt that goes with like this, like purple and green amoeba necklace. But okay, well, that necklace kind of looks like you're coming off the set of the Mummy. Maybe we should go back to Universal Studios. You could like be one of the people that walk around. <laughs> We're going to open up the February edition of the Keto Crate, and we're going to give one away. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos and we do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics. And then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. It's Keto Crate time! It is, but like right now, it's not quite February yet, so I'm still kind of sad. I know, but we gotta do this. Like gotta do it. Two more days. Two more days, so we can't eat anything that's in here. So if you're new to our channel, this is the Keto Crate. Keto Crate is a monthly subscription box. It has 10 to 12 goodies in here, different things. We like it because you can try things without buying an entire case of it. Right. And uh, everything in here has kind of got a rule. But here's the thing. We're going to give one of these away at the end of the video. But if you're interested in one, there's a link down below. That link's also going to get you a discount off of your very first box. Now, if you've never watched us open one of these before, the way we do this is we're going to look at everything that's in here. And we're, get excited that in a couple of days, we're going to eat everything that's in here. <laughs> we're we're going to go over everything that's in here. We're going to go over the ingredients, go over the macros, and then finally let you know how much it costs. Aww. This is what the inside of a box looks like. I'm already seeing it looks like Valentine's Day. I see a Valentine. Day. So you ready to get started on this? Yes, I am. Okay, we're going to put this off to the side. They always have something cute. Oh my gosh, look at this. They actually have Valentines that you could like cut out and give to somebody. Well, I found They're something just... that I don't really love. It's the Love Good Fats bar. Love Good Fats. Never been a fan of these. We've wanted to love these. But. So hard. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. So the ingredients are a lot. A lot. Here we go. It is a fats blend, which is peanut butter, palm sternin, coconut oil, peanut oil. Then we have a chocolate flavored coating, which is chicory root fiber, palm kernel, and palm oil. Brown rice protein, cocoa powder, processed with alkali, sunflower lecithin, and salt. Then we have peanut flour. Then we have whey protein, isolate, soluble corn fiber, rice flour, peanuts, chicory root fiber, semi-sweet chocolate chips, which is cane sugar and chocolate liqueur, cocoa butter, sunflower lecithin, vanilla extract. Then we have cocoa powder, processed with alkali, sea salt, uh, uh, tofurols, Stevia leaf actor. Why bother? You've already got cane sugar in here. I feel like my cup says it all. And run for us. Run for us. Run. run. We have nutrition facts is 200 calories, one bar, 14 grams of fat, 12 total carbohydrates, seven grams of dietary fiber, zero sugar alcohols. Um, they don't need them. They 10 got grams regular of sugar. protein. Wait a second. That, oh, that would make it five net carbs. And. Yeah. Yeah. No, Poor thank thing. you. Like, it's getting worse. It's it getting worse. But I will tell you how much that stuff costs. And that is, this is last month's box up here. I, that's why I was thinking to myself. Like, so, I'm not seeing it. So they don't even have the new box up here yet. Okay. So now what? We will put the price down in front of us. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Because yep. we got our box and the Keto Crate price isn't up there. So we're going to put the price down here. I know it's about $3 a bar. I can tell you that much. Yeah. Ready? Yes. Here you go. Puff, snack House Puffs Cheeseburger. That sounds good. Because he's my cheeseburger. I love that song. <laughs> Veggie Tales. Okay, so I like big buns and I cannot lie. I am loving this company already. Okay, I, I just... I really am hoping this is good ingredients, but that looks like a long ingredient list to me. It does. It says that it's milk protein isolate, sunflower oil, cheddar cheese powder, 
which is whey buttermilk solids, granular and cheddar cheeses, pasteurized milk, cheese culture, salt, and enzymes. There's whey protein concentrate, salt, sodium phosphate, citric acid, yellow five and six, onion powder, sea salt, yeast extracts, which is baker's yeast, canola oil, natural flavors, paprika vinegar powder, which is multidextrin, white distilled vinegar, modified food starch, garlic powder, tomato powder, sugar, gum arabic, natural flavor, tricalcium phosphate, silicon dioxide, and cornstarch. What? Okay, so I mean, that's all the seasoning and the flavor. Were we just but... blinded by the cuteness of okay. this? Okay, so a serving is uh, per package, one package in a serving, 110 calories, 4.75 grams of fat, 15 grams of protein. It sounds like it's a protein puff. Two total carbs, two total carbs. Okay. So, I'm willing to try it. I yeah. mean, all of that maltodextrin stuff is in the seasoning. Obviously, it's kind of low, but I mean, it is what it is. I'd, I'd rather it be cleaner, I, but... I love the jokes. I'm all like in the, the jokes? jokes. Yes. I like big buns and I cannot lie. Come on now. It's time to be good to go. It's good to go. It's good to go bars. We actually had these before. It's not bad, but it kind of, for me, lacks flavor. But some people really like them. Yeah. But taste is subjective. The ingredients are almond flour, inulin, erythritol, vegetable glycerin, which is a sugar alcohol, apple cider vinegar, natural flavors, ground chia seeds, salt, uh, baking soda, rosemary extra, mixed uh, tofurols, organic. It's everything's got an asterisk. It all says that all means organic. Super so it's organic. got really good ingredients. So serving size is one bar, like the whole thing: 170 calories, 13 Obviously. grams of fat, six grams of protein. Uh, 16 total carbohydrates, 7 grams of dietary fiber, 5 grams of erythritol, which makes that, what, 4 net carbs. So, yeah, it's it's honestly, like, got good ingredients and the macros are good. I find it a little lacking in flavor, so not worth it for me, but some people really, really like it. And again, we'll just continue to put the price in front of us. Yeah. Ready? Yes. I want that. Yes. I want the Valentine. Please. From Please our good friends... At Chalk Zero. Oh my gosh, it's Chalk Zero. How cute is this? I'm really glad we okay, can't eat anything today because I'd be eating that whole I thing. I would totally eat it's this. it's raspberry. It's raspberry and it looks like a rose. This is very nice. So it's a dark chocolate rose. Um, the ingredients are dark chocolate, unsweetened chocolate and cocoa butter, soluble corn fiber, non-GMO resistant dextrin, sunflower lecithin, dry raspberry, monk fruit mm -hmm. extract, and Madagascar bourbon vanilla beans. Uh, there's actually three servings in a container. It's kind of like when you get an Easter bunny. You can't eat that whole bunny in one sitting or Why you shouldn't. Not? 110 calories per serving, 11 grams of fat, one gram of protein, 15 total carbs, 13 dietary fiber, no sugar alcohol. So you're looking at what? Two net carbs. Okay, so here's the thing. This is why we do like, we, we always tell people like, if you're gonna do a net carbs, make sure you put a total carb cap. Right. Because I would look at this going 330 calories, like I'll eat that in a whole sitting. No problem, I can no eat problem. that in a sitting. Oh yeah, I can And it's only that. gonna be six net carbs, but it would be 45 total carbs. Like, and that is probably gonna mess with almost everybody. Yeah. So that's why, yeah, because like, Seeing two net carbs, I'd be like, no problem. I'm, I'm I'm willing to eat the whole thing, but I'm not willing to eat 45 total carbs. But this is so beautiful. It is and really beautiful. I don't want to have to miss out on pretty things and like you know a Valentine just because I'm keto. Yeah. So I like this. We'll put a, we have a we're, we're affiliates of them. We have a discount code. It's two crazy ketos. We'll put a link for it down below. I think you can order these now. Valentine. Are you ready? Lots, lots of protein in here. Yeah. And that's good because I'm on a protein kick right now, right? Like I'm working with Bronson. He's got me eating a lot of protein. Lots of protein for so, you. So, better than good foods, protein breakfast puffs. Cinnamon roll flavored. This is veggie, veggie infused. Veggie infused, okay. So there is a little bit of copy, so we're gonna have to read this, because this is interesting. So it says, cinnamon roll with a crunch. We launched our snack company to offer better nutrition for our four-year-old son when he was going through leukemia. Breakfast wow. is always a challenge for busy families, and we wanted something better than the grab-and-go breakfast options that our kids currently have. That's the truth. Yeah. That's how Cinnamon Roll Crunch was born. And with every purchase, a portion of the proceeds goes to help families battling childhood cancer. Wow, that's awesome. So the ingredients in this are white confectionery coating, which is inulin, palm kernel oil, non-fat dry milk, sunflower lecithin, vanilla powder, salt, and stevia. 
Then we have milk protein isolate, fruit and vegetable blend, broccoli, spinach, kale, pumpkin, sweet potato, sunflower seeds, kelp, calora. In a cinnamon bun. Mat my take mushroom and shiitake mushrooms and cinnamon. Wow, those are clean ingredients. Like I want to eat these so bad. Is it? Can we? Can we just say close enough? No, close enough. Close enough. Nope. Close enough. One more day. Come on. Two more days. Oh. Today and tomorrow. Yeah, but technically we can go at midnight on Sunday. You're so, so cute. Okay. Serving size. There's two servings in this bag. Is there though? 170. There's a lot in here. Is there? Like there's a, the bag is stuffed. Like I could definitely see splitting this into two. It would last a whole movie. Um, servings, so two servings in a container, 170 calories per serving, 10 grams of fat, uh, 10 grams of protein, 16 total carbohydrates, 12 grams of dietary fiber, four grams of sugar alcohol, making it zero net carbs. Wow. Zero net carbs. Wow, that's interesting. But here's the thing, like, there's no like added fiber. The fiber is from spinach, kale, pumpkin, sweet potato, sunflower seeds, kelp, like mushroom. Like there's no like we're adding a bunch of wonky fibers that I gotta so worry about. So that we can about. subtract like, it. I'm like really excited about this one. I, I am can't too. wait to find out how much that costs. Well, and I actually love all of this stuff because there's some people who will not give the keto lifestyle a shot without grab and go items. They're just not doing it. Yeah. So like, let's have some grab and go items for them. Here's another one for you. Moon cheese. This is like, we're getting ready for a road trip I, because there's lots of road trip food in here. Road trip, road house. <laughs> All right, so this is moon cheese. We love moon cheese. This is white cheddar, black pepper. Is this like new packaging? I like this it packaging. It is, it's not orange. I'm used to orange. Crunchy bites of savory fun. So inside of the moon cheese, white cheddar cheese, pasteurized milk, salt, cheese cultures, enzymes, black pepper seasoning, which is spices, salt, onion, garlic powder, yeast extract, citric acid, and silicon dioxide. That's just the seasoning on top of it. Mm -hmm. 180 calories per container. 14 grams of fat, 10 grams of protein, two total carbs. That sounds good. It sounds really I'll trade good. You. you can keep the chalk zero if I can keep that. If you can keep the moon cheese, I really want to at least try a bite though. <laughs> one one little moon. Kiss my keto. Kiss my keto. How many of you guys watch that show? Like, Kiss my grits? Kiss you mean my, Alice? Alice. That was such an awesome show. Kiss my keto. Okay, so this is dark chocolate pumpkin seeds and sea salt. I, I guess they have a new packaging because we Very had cute. their chocolate bars. We actually have a review of their chocolate bars from yes. a long time ago. I'll leave a link up here. But, Delicious. Um, okay, here we go. I haven't had this in a long, long Me time. Me neither. The ingredients are unsweetened chocolate, inulin, erythritol, cocoa butter, pumpkin seeds, sunflower less than vanilla powder, stevia extract, and sea salt. So good clean ingredients. Very nice. There are uh -uh, three servings in this container. But that's a big bar. It's a big bar. bar, but yeah. Like, come on, I wanna be able to eat like an entire bar. I know I can't, but. You can't though. Okay, so 120 calories per serving. Get so, that out of your mind. So that's 360 calories for the whole bar. Uh, 11 grams of fat. And then we have two grams of protein, 14 total carbohydrates, eight grams of dietary fiber, and five grams of erythritol. That's making it, what, three net carbs? I no, love one net carb. I love that they have like the 350 for like the container for you. Like they know somebody's gonna open this and just eat the whole thing. One net carb, but it is what, 14, 28, yeah, way too many total carbs for me. So yep. it, to eat a whole bar, to eat a whole bar is what it's I It's going to be delicious. So, okay. Who's next? We got another protein puff. Shrewd. These are good. Shrewd Keto Dippers Milk Chocolate Coated Protein Puffs. Says it's the smartest way to, to keto. Anthony and I had these a couple months ago in our keto box. We didn't save any for you. They are so good. Shrewd food. They are so good. So you gotta save this one for me. Inside of here, it says no sugar added milk chocolate, which is cocoa butter, erythritol, unsweetened chocolate, whole milk powder, inulin, non-fat dry milk, soy lecithin, natural vanilla extract, salt, and stevia extract with milk protein isolate. A bag is 150 calories, 11 grams of fat, seven grams of protein, 14 total carbs, five dietary uh, fiber, and six sugar alcohol. So you're looking at what? Three, Three net, net carbs. carbs. Very nice. I'm excited about that. It's gonna be like a Ooh. Whopper. Ooh, this is interesting. 
Is that pudding, Simply sir? Simply delish, natural chocolate flavor, instant pudding. How nice. Chocolate pudding. Okay, so the ingredients in this are starch. Wait, the first ingredient? Potato starch. Erythritol, what? cocoa, emulsifiers. What are your emulsifiers? Please tell me. Stevia extract, salt, natural flavors, which is vanilla. Okay. In a, in a chocolate? In a chocolate pudding. Okay, now I know that some people are okay with resistant starches, like resistant potato starch. I'm personally not. Why is but, that the first ingredient? Okay. Um, there are four servings in this container. Has anybody ever made a box of pudding before? Like, remember the Jello pudding? I've never made just that's one serving. One serving. Well, no, no. But when you make the whole box, like you would make the, you have to make the whole box, right? That was one, maybe, maybe two, two. Serving. So maybe two. I'll serving. share it with you. I'll share it, but I'm certainly not only eating one, right? Like, if you want one, go buy, like, the little pudding cups. Right, the Because snack cup. at least I will only eat one. Yeah. Okay, so a serving size is a quarter of a package. There's 30 calories in that serving, zero grams of fat, one gram of protein. Okay, you're supposed to also use one and a quarter cups of milk substitute. They're not telling us whether or not, or you can use regular milk, which why would you if you're keto? Um, they're not telling you if these, I don't think that's including that, okay? Nine total carbohydrates. Less than one gram of dietary fiber, and then four sugar alcohol, making it five net carbs. They are making a low calorie thing. That's what they're concerned with. The energy has been put into not getting good ingredients, yeah. into looking like a diet food. That is not what keto is. So if you're gonna make something that's like a keto product, like maybe listen to what keto is. And remember, there's no such thing as a keto food. So 2021, there are gonna be even more products entering the market. We've gotta scrutinize ingredients. The funny part is, is they actually make a jello that's really good. I liked the jello, but now I'm not touching that. Okay. Yeah. You're up. Pork rinds. So this is Southern recipe, small batch, sea salt and cracked uh, black pepper pork rinds. Fried in sunflower oil. So thanks for that. Because it came with its own skin. I right. don't know why. At we're least doing. it's sunflower oil, but yeah, it's still not the best. Okay. So the ingredients are in this are pork rinds, sunflower oil, salt, maltodextrin, sea salt, black pepper, yeast extract, onion powder, citric acid, garlic powder, and natural flavorings. There's 130 <laughs> calories. Well, I'm gonna have so much to pick up. Eight grams of fat, 14 grams of protein, one gram of total carbohydrates, and that's it. So okay. they're saying one total carb. Don't th throw it. Anthony will eat it. Okay. But come on now. Now, I mean, hey, listen. It's better than eating potato chips. I just, there's no reason for the maltodextrin. I mean, no. just like the other thing, there, I, I get disappointed when I see maltodextrin in the seasoning, so I know they have to bind it to something, but... I don't like it in my pork rinds. And I know most flavored pork rinds have it, but there's also lots of brands of pork rinds that are doing it without maltodextrin. So I'm just gonna keep saying to myself what I said at the beginning of this, which is I'm glad that there's grab and glow options for people who are just starting out. Mm -hmm. Let's like get better and better each day though. Front porch pecans. Okay, I've got high hopes for this. Pecans. Put, okay, thank you. And peanut oil. All right. And sea salt. Okay, I'm in. Okay. Let's do this. And uh, there's for it. four servings per container. Okay. Now they say a serving size is 14 pieces. Side note, when a serving size is 14 pieces, don't count 14 pieces. Go get a yeah. scale if, if you're, you're going to really try it. to have a serving size. Yeah. Because you're most likely like me. And Once there broken. is no difference between the broken piece like this and the malformed piece that's like this, right? You know the one where it didn't come apart when they took it out of the shell, so you yeah. have two halves? That's one piece. That's if one. they're joined, that's one piece. It is. And that's the same as the broken piece. So you what happens it, is I eat all the can't go wrong. solid pieces and then leave all the broken pieces for Rachel and say, here's your 14 pieces because See? we're eating 14 what pieces. What I'm dealing with here? Right? So no, wait, you gotta weigh it out because like every piece is different. Yeah. So, okay, 200, by the way, I don't really do that. I'm just like making a point. We We're weigh everything out. asking for a friend? Yeah. 210 calories per serving, 22 grams of fat, 
and then it's got two grams of protein, four total carbohydrates, three grams of dietary fiber, making it one net carb. This is the sea salt flavor with no sugar added. Nice, I like it. Only two items left. <gasps> Ooh. There you go. I see something I love, and that is Super, super coffee. coffee. We love super coffee. So this is the mocha flavor. These things are really good actually. Mm -hmm. And they can't be pricey, so it's nice to get them in a keto crate and that way you don't have to buy a whole big ton what of What flavor is this one? Mocha. Mocha. So one can is 80 calories, three grams of fat, 10 grams of protein, four total carbs, two dietary fibers, so two net carbs. Inside of this little can, which always feels really good, is uh, Colombian coffee, which is water and coffee. There's milk, protein isolate, cocoa powder, MCT oil, potassium phosphate, natural flavor, monk fruit, organic green coffee, caffeine, and gallum gum. So they used to be much lower in total carbs. The total carbs went up, but I really don't see a giant difference in the ingredients. No. I think that the change is like the new FDA labeling guidelines. It's just, you know, but before it was one carb, now it's four. So I don't drink them nearly as much as I used to, but we still love them and still order them. We do. And I will say that these put a pep in my step. Mm -hmm. And I mean, I am a huge coffee drinker, which you guys well know. Um, so what I usually do, and they're very flavorful too. So a lot of times what I will do is put this over ice and then fill up the um, the can again with water and then pour that over it. So yeah. it does make it last longer. And, and I'm telling you, there's a lot of flavor in these. There's a link down below. I think we have a coupon code for it too. If we do, it's down in the description. Oh, Anthony's gonna be happy. There's a meat oh, stick. Oh, this one's not going to Anthony. Uh, last item. This is the F-bomb. Oh, thank goodness. F-bomb, drop an F-bomb.com. We love them. Salt and pepper pork stick. So this has, ooh. I can actually read this because I'm wearing my glasses. Good job. Ingredients are, it's tiny, but I can read it. Pork, water, sea salt, which is cracked, uh, cracked black pepper, okay. encapsulated citric acid, cultured celery powder, which is celery powder and sea salt, cherry powder, natural liquid smoke, coriander, ground clove, and... Uh, colored beef collagen casings. So good ingredients. And they're usually very fatty and delicious. Yeah, so it's 120 calories per stick, 10 grams of protein, six grams, uh, 10 grams of fat, six grams of protein, one total carbohydrate. So it's 75% fat, 20% protein, 3% total carbs. That's the good. end of the box. Yeah, we got a meat stick. We finished on a high note. We're gonna give one of these boxes away. So here's what you're gonna have to do. You're going to, number one, hit the like button on this video because it really helps build the channel. Hopefully you've watched the video all the way to the end because that helps the channel too. Live in the United States. You gotta live in the United States. Sorry about that. Yeah. Um, you're going to make sure you subscribe to the channel. Then you're gonna leave a comment down below. Any comment that you want. Now, if you don't wanna win the box, that's okay. But if you wanna leave a comment anyway, yeah. like tell us which one of these items do you really wanna try and which one would you toss over your shoulder? Which I'm one would curious. you run, for us run? Yeah, run, for us run. Yeah. Or eat, or maybe you want to eat it all. And again, we're we're a little bit different than everybody else. So let us know down below. If you don't want to win, that's okay. Just tell us in the comment that you don't want to win and we'll pick somebody else. And we're going to pick the winner during the filming of next week's 100th episode of Keto on the Couch. Wow. So um, you have until Saturday at noon, I'll All put right. that date right here. That's when you have to put your entry in by because that's when we film Keto on the Couch. Yeah. So if you're watching this on Sunday, then too late. <laughs> Next Sunday. But have a great Sunday. <laughs> but have a great Sunday. So guys, let us know again down in the comment section which of these products really intrigue you. Let us know if you get a Keto Crate or if you want to get a Keto Crate. And if you like seeing videos like this, we have a whole bunch of other videos that you might like and I'm gonna link some of them right down there. Also, make sure you take a look at our most recent video, which you're gonna find right over here. But whether you head this way or you head this way, don't forget to head this way. Subscribe to our channel and click the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Till next time. Bye. Bye.